So this year's uh, Military Appreciation Night hockey game, where all proceeds benefit the Wounded Warrior Project, is going to be on October 26th at 7 p.m. at Hershey Park Arena. Some of the raffle items include a signed hockey jersey, LVC jersey, other LVC sports attire such as hoodies, jackets, t-shirts, and also local gift certificates to restaurants around the area. Uh, the jersey auction ends at the conclusion or at the start of the second period, whereas all the raffle items are pulled right at the end of the second right at the end of the second period. So here you can buy tickets to put in all these different items. You can bid on the jerseys, which is open online now on GoDutchman.com and at the game. And also you can buy our custom-made t-shirts, which are, we are currently selling at school, but they will also be available at the game. Uh, this is our third year doing this event. It all started with Rich Drazen and our old coach Spiros and Astis. They kind of took the reins and showed a few of, our, few of us how to do it uh, each year. We, the game's scheduled against the Navy, so whenever that date is, and we start designing jerseys, designing t-shirts, we start writing, uh, forming our corporate letters, we communicate with different members of the school on how to advertise, we go door to door to local businesses, and all this is done through the team. So uh, our team plays a huge role in doing this. It all starts in the summer and goes right up until the end of the game. Uh, the Wounded Warrior Project really struck uh, stuck to me because of all the publicity that I see through other college sports. I've seen South Carolina do their Wounded Warrior games. I've seen other D3 programs such as Hobart do a Wounded Warrior game, and I just thought it was something cool that LVC should hop on and join. But I feel that our military is very important to the country, and I feel that we should try and help people that help keep us safe and help keep America the way that it runs.